the day before this happened, I believed in God and I believe in more in God right now. Mayor Adams says he's been flooded with support. New Yorkers sending him words of encouragement and even emojis, which the FBI may have seen when they seized his phones last week. The countless number of people who send me either prayer hands, scriptures. But the mayor's answers today offered little detail on why the FBI seized his phones and whether anyone else on his team has been searched. We are fully co cooperating with it, and my role is to allow them to do their job without interference. Questions remain about whether Mayor Adams' campaign in 2021 improperly accepted foreign money from Turkish donors and whether there was a connection when Adams, then borough president, asked then-Fire Commissioner Dan Nigro to help expedite the opening of the new Turkish consulate, where there were unresolved safety issues. Mayor Adams insists it was just the normal government business of trying to get stuff done. This is what we do every day. You know, you reach out to an agency and ask them to look into a matter. You don't reach out to an agency to compel them to do anything, because I had no authority to do so. I was the borough president. And so, yes, we reached out. Adams notes he was advocating on behalf of Brooklyn's large Turkish population. But the most consequential question is whether the FBI believes the mayor did anything wrong. Did the warrant that you were presented with uh, for the seizure of your phones name you as a target of the investigation or a witness? The mayor's chief counsel answered that question. No one has been accused of wrongdoing in the investigation, uh, to my knowledge, and uh, there has been no indication that I've seen that the mayor is a target. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.